Hey guys, what's up? Um, today we're going to be practicing a bit basically. Oh, my name is Sean Result, and welcome to my Duff programming series, which I always say, and yeah. Anyway, um, we're going to be practicing a bit. We're going to be learning how to make a static login page, basically a form. Let's add a label. Let's add a labeled edit component. Labeled edit component. We'll just say uh, enter user name. It will change the font to bold and 16. Uh, the, the normal font will also be 16. Just enter username here. And then we'll have another one. Oh, I did not mean to delete it. Uh, it will be enter password and let's add a button button which will just say log in uh, make the phone also 16 let's make it 20 let's make it position uh, screen center change the form caption to log in so if we compile now then you guys will basically enter username and password but we don't want to get people to see our password so we click on the label edit and look for the password jar and make this an asterisk sign so if you compile now and start typing the password to basically show us the asterisk sign or this um, dots depends um, um, we, which version of Delphi or Windows you have yes let's rename the stuff edt <coughs> sorry username edt password Login it so let's start if we we'll have two stuff because we we'll have to check for the password and the uh, username to be correct. So let's edt username dot text. Let's say if the, the username is um, let's make Sean result because I'm programming now Sean result. And the password should be since the password is equal to uh, let's make it Delphi123. They display a message that basically says show message successfully logged. I don't know how to spell successfully. I think that's correct. Could be wrong. Success. Success. I think it's good. Successfully logged in. Else it should display show message username or password is incorrect. So let's compile. Let's say we enter Sean result password is Delphi123 login successfully logged in. But if for instance add lowercase r would be incorrect because it's huh that's weird. Oops, I had or this should be an and if it's or then it basically accepts this or this. So we will want an AND. So now you guys also somewhere reviewed the uh, OR. Anyway, shown result. Delphi123. So this works. If you make this a lowercase, then it will not correct because it wants this and this. But it only received this password. You also can't anything else 
for instance, if the wrong password was being incorrect. So that's nice and all, but let's add a, another form. Uh, VCL form, which I haven't worked with forms in a while. Um, let me just have a label here, basically. Top. And. Uh, hmm, we'll do that with code. Okay. Then we'll have a basic an image component here, just. So guys, now you can add an image from here, which I'll add now. Um, not add, just going to show you guys something. So let's add this. Hmm, yes, I'm going to add this one. I want to add this one. Okay, let's add this photo of me. Let's stretch it. Okay, let's add another label. As level here, let's call it uh, LBL name. Let's add another one. Let's call this one LBL surname. Uh, add an age, LBL age. Okay. Add a button line to the bottom, and we'll just leave it like that. Also, okay. So, if we are logged in successfully, then we we'll want to instead say form 2 dot show. Let's first add it to the users list. Users, I guess that will work. Else, do that. So, if we now Login correct, it will show us the form, but let's not yet do that. Just make it a bit more easier for now. Let's make it use username SR and password D123. Okay, and let's make this display in the position of the main form center. Change the caption to logged in so basically we'll make this our um, profile page oops uh, did I change this label name no it should be lbl uh, top and we can leave this button one okay if you're logged in we can want to say form 2 dot lbl top dot Caption colon equals successfully logged in, and then we also form two dot level top LBL top dot font dot size colon equals sixteen. So you can actually, so you can actually change the font size with code also. They will say form two dot LBL name dot caption color equals make this shown and also change the font level dot oops font dot size we'll also make it make it 15 I'm lazy I'm lazy so I'm copying pasting now dot lbl surname So we just split it a bit. Okay, did a two dot LBL age dot caption is equal to um, eighteen dot to string. So you can do it like this, or you could do it like. But there's, there's, there's plenty of ways to do it. Um, string, oops, int to string. Or you could also do it like just 
just because we just basically want this string so these are the other two ways to do this now so you can also actually have this as 15 dot to integer but you know, why would you want that just yeah also actually why would you want this when you could just have that I'm just doing this to show you guys so yep dot 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 font dot size colon equals 15 also did the form two dot button one dot caption colon equals log out form two dot dot button dot four dot size will make it pretty like it's basically done as f9 enter sr and d123 login and we can basically now see our profile here as you guys can see this looks nice okay let's code the log out button and also before we do the log out button as you guys can see it really takes next it really takes a lot of time to keep writing form 2 dot form 2 dot form 2 dot so we can actually just use the with thing so you can say with form 2 to begin and end basically then we'll, we'll use the form 2 and we don't have to write it every time so then we can leave it just like this also so also we works work with other stuff like we can just say form like LVL top then we don't have to write top so yes uh, let's go to code the uh, logout button which will just be form 2 dot hide so sr d123 logout where the form I mean login and log out we also want to clear this values when we are logged in so the yeah it's clear that after we have logged in we'll have to clear it so edt username dot clear and also edt password dot clear okay so if it's incorrect for instance srd123 that's incorrect and this is correct it will log us in and boom so actually guys i think um in the future we're going to be making a facebook clone i think that would think that we would, would be pretty nice to make a facebook clone um this is basically us the start of our facebook clone yeah we'll keep improving it like i've, I've actually made a facebook kind of clone in the past let me see if i can quickly find it um uh, yeah here it is it was, it was actually my grade 11 um it it pad so we had to make a social net network and i kind of make it made a facebook clone like you can sign up and stuff and um how to fill in it's just how to fill in quickly and add this a five five two five five okay uh we'll sign up like this and password is this is my password login this is basically our home and information we can edit, edit the information and search for people like me and search for myself yes here's my profile I can write myself as this person um, I can view uh, my photos can send him a message oops like sending that message basically that was my my, my pat and yeah it was actually a really fun pat to do I really like making a social network anyway guys um, I think we, we're also going to be making uh, making a Facebook clone a better one than my than my than mine one than mine because it was that was like two years ago Anyway, so I think it's, it would be nice to make, a, to make a Facebook clone. You might do that in the, in the future videos. Anyway, for now, guys, 
Uh, thanks for watching. Please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. I'll see you in, in the next video.